Hello everyone, welcome to another Exos Heroes content. In today's video, we're going to discuss the Choice Fate Core banner that's going to drop tomorrow, and I'll give you a sneak peek before you purchase the Exos Pass Season 3. So before we proceed, please subscribe to the button down below. As you can see, there will be a banner dropping for a Choice Fate Core for your First Guardians. Uh, this will drop by tomorrow But before you select your hero, I would like to discuss with you um, What are my recommendations especially depending on which part of the game that you are on right now? So before we proceed just examine first what your needs are in terms of what you need right now in the stage of the game so for different type of stages that you are in I think you will need uh, a different type of hero if you've already collected most of the Guardian or, or the first Guardians I think you would only opt for gar first Guardians that you have not summoned yet but if you're a beginner I would suggest that you that you recruit FC Rera or you recruit FC Anastasia because they are mostly your core members in today's meta especially FC Rera FC Rera can be used in in the campaign she can be used in your chapters basically in any content uh, in the game right now especially in your PvP while FC Anastasia is also a support character that can also help your team um, this banner is a really good good very very good um, drop for line games because this benefits more the beginners who just started and who was not able to get uh, at least one of the FC characters that dropped I think a month ago so again the same the same uh, percentages would apply so for gold you'll have a 0.5% and for black you'll have 0.7% and also the core mileages are also the same for black tier your your uh, guaranteed recruitment requires 19 core mileages and also for your gold tier your guaranteed recruitment requires 28 core mileages so please be sure that you ha have enough sets for this and um, please make sure that you try to at least summon for one uh, especially if you have the zest because um, they will play a big role in your roster and your collection of heroes so for this one the initial recruitment they gave us a discount of only 200 zest so your first recruitment will only require 200 zest but the succeeding ones you will be you will be charged already with 700 zest so for our next feature for today i'll take you to the exos pass that i recently opened so again we have here the exos pass for the premium for the premium uh, portion down below if you can see there are new rewards incorporated to the exos pass so the new ones are this one the die coupon you'll be getting some i think you'll be getting six for this one and also if you notice there are a lot of faded helmets faded equipment that are here in the premium portion of the exos pass so this is a big improvement from what they released for season one and season two um, there are a lot of better items here and eventually they have changed the biggest item that you'll be getting for this one so but before that they also included uh, R1 legendary equipment and uh, they've included a lot of R1 equipment here 
So we go to the final reward that you'll be getting. You'll be getting a special Fated Hero selection ticket in which you can get Dorka for this one if you're, if you're looking for her. But for this one, you can also get Garf, Rachel, Bathory, Shifraken, Junai, and most especially Dorka. So again, guys, that is it for me. This is just a short video and a, and a sneak peek into what you'll be getting if you pay for the 3,000 gems for the Exos Pass. So again, you all stay safe and you have a nice day. Warden out.